Okay, so has this ever happened to you when you've installed a fresh version of Apache um, on Linux and you're like, okay, site looks to be great, and you go to one of your links and you get a failure, and you're like, what's going on? Everything else is fine. How could this one page be the problem? Well, this page is redirected with HD access. Everything's routed to the index page because I'm using a framework. So you're thinking, okay, HD access is messed up. So let's go to our HD access file, and let's say, okay, first thing, let me get rid of that. So first thing uh, what we should do is throw in some random text in our HD access file, because if we have some random text in here, and it's reading the file, it should throw a 500 error. If it if we get nothing, so let's refresh. Okay, so we still get nothing. We don't even get a 500 error. This would definitely cause a 500 error. Okay, so th our first problem is that our HD access file isn't being read at all. So we're going to go to our server. We're going to go to slash uh, etc slash Apache2, and then we're going to go to sites enabled, and we're going to double click the file that's in here to open it for editing. What we what we need to change in here is see these these this block and this block okay well this block doesn't really matter um, it's this block and this block the blocks that actually say hey var www let's do some shit here so we're gonna change allow override to all and we're gonna change allow override to all okay that's gonna allow us to access our var www save that and you may you may not be able to save this just like I did because I'm logged in as root um, but you may need to give yourself permission first um, that's not explained here, but you need to be able to change this. Okay, so now we're going to refresh our page and, oh, no change. That's because you have to restart Apache. So just pull up your terminal and do a sudo slash etc slash init dot d slash apache2 space restart. And Apache will restart. And now refresh your page and, all right, 500 error. It doesn't say 500, internal server error, which is great. That means our HD access is now being read. So all we should have to do is delete this, save, and you don't have to restart Apache for HD access, and now we should. Oh, we're still getting an error. So we're like, okay, what's wrong with that? So the only, so now that we are sure it's reading our file, now we've got a problem with our HD access. Well, we have an if condition in here. So let's see what happens if we get rid of our if condition. Let's just straight um, do the rewrite engine. So if we refresh this, we get a server error. Well, that means that our, our our rewrite module is not in existence, okay? So we need to actually add our rewrite module. So what we're going to do is go back to our server, and we're going to go to um, mods enabled. And we need to have, um, well, what needs to be enabled is rewrite.load. So we're looking for a rewrite, and it, it, it doesn't exist here. So let's go to Apache 2 mods available and see if it's here. So we're going to say... Um, Rewrite. Oh, and there it is right here. Rewrite.load. Beautiful. So we're just going to kind of download that um, to our desktop and go to mods enabled and then just kind of throw that in there. Wow, I have way too much on my desktop. Oh, there it is. I found it. All right, and just toss that in here. Okay, so now we're going to restart Apache one more time now that our rewrite module is in there. Great. And now we're going to refresh our page and ta da! Now HT access is correctly. Um, working and we've got our rewrite module added.